Alright, guys, welcome back to Mass Effect uh, 2. And uh, we're gonna finish up the Morning's Love quest line here. Or will we? How the fuck? You killed the Blood Pack guards. Not Blood Pack, not member of Clan Werelock. Wrong clan markings. I'm a nerd, not scout. Werelock guards got me. Brought me here. You don't look so good. Are you injured? They gave me things. Injections, mostly. Sometimes gas. Made me sick. Fever. Aches. Can't keep food down. They're fixing the genophage. I'm making a sacrifice. For all, Krogan. You're safe now. Just get back to your camp. I'll deal with the werelock. You can't do that. You can't stop them. Don't you understand? They're curing the genophage. They're gonna make it all better. They have to keep doing the tests. Caution, Shepard. Patient unstable, susceptible, brainwashed. Why do you want them to keep doing the tests? This is my fault. I got caught. Wasn't strong enough. Not good enough. This is the best I can do. This is all I can do. I'm not big enough to have a real shot with the females. I'll never have kids of my own. But if I help undo the genophage, then I mattered. You've got a bruised ego. You got caught and beaten, so you tell yourself it was for something important. That's not true. I need to stay. They're gonna cure us all. You're not a real Krogan. When a real Krogan gets knocked down, he gets back up. I did. I got back up every time they hit me. So many times. You're lying there right now like a Vorcha grubbing in the mud. You gonna just lie there, Vorcha? Screw you, Schumann. Nobody says that to me. Nobody keeps me down. Damn right they don't. Now get back to Clan Erdnot and report in. Go. Go. Nicely done. Fortunately, subject is unlikely to be contagious. Very nice. How oh, is this one? Ah, uh, we got Renegade at points, Paragon points, and credits. Nice. All very good. Shepard, I'm detecting crates ahead that are holding unstable materials. A misplaced shot could cause a significant explosion. Or a well placed shot. Explosives useful. Burn through the. Uh. I mean, this guy doesn't seem to really do much. There you go. The man with the shotgun is, uh... Alright, where right, we go? We got a couple of money. Circuit boards. Why can't we find a peaceful solution at all? Ever. Enjoy. I'm trying to think of games that actually have a lot of that, you know, where you find like peaceful resol resolutions and stuff. I think Knights of the Old Republic had a lot of that. I don't remember though. Because I know Mass Effect 1 kind of had that. I mean, you kinda, you could avoid boss fights with uh, Renegade and Paragon, particularly at the end. I mean, I was going to shoot that one, but okay. I mean, as long as I just stay at long range, he's, what's he going to do? Alright. I like how it gets all glowing sparkly. Sorry, I muted my mic for some sneezes. Oh, they, oh, of course they were. They were just standing in this room here. I should have known better. There's a little piece of paper. 
Dude, this, this would actually hit both of them. That guy has like a... What the fuck? <laughs> what? what the fuck is this auto error? And why are you over there not helping me out? Fuck, he healed. What is doing damage to me right now? Is he you? Oh shit, he's actually hurting me. And, and now I'm out of ammo. Like, now you're dead! Every time he does that, oh what the fuck? It's actually someone. Well, it's, uh, gold, but he's just getting wrecked. Alright. These boss fights are really hit and miss a lot of the time. Alright, so that's where we're supposed to go, so let's go over here first. No? Okay, apparently it's that way, so let's go here first. This objective marker is, uh, very misleading sometimes. Of course. Lost crate. There we go. Thank god we skipped all the fucking mini games. Nobody likes that shit. I'm sure we're getting close to the end now. I can feel it. In my funny bone. Now what's this? Heavy weapon ammo. Alright, yeah. That's gonna be useful. Man. Alive, unharmed. No signs of restraint, no evidence of torture. Don't understand. For such a smart man, Professor, you always had trouble seeing evidence that disagreed with your preconceptions. How long will it take you to admit that I'm here because I wish to be here? Maybe the Werelock brainwashed or drugged him to keep him under control. Unlikely. Pupil's normal. Body language consistent with standard metabolic state. Please, Professor, you wrote a paper on this. Forced behavior modification always results in mental degradation. Whether from Reaper indoctrination or drugs, test subjects always lose higher cognitive function. Not brainwashed or conditioned. Need Malin at peak capacity for work. Must be alternate source of coercion. The Blood Pack never kidnapped Malin. He went to them. He's working on a cure voluntarily. Contact said he was with Blood Pack. Assumed. But why? Never argued with necessity of Genophage. How was I supposed to disagree with the great Dr. Solus? I was your student! I looked up to you! Experiments performed here. Live subjects, prisoners, torture and executions. You're doing? We've already got the blood of millions on our hands, Doctor. If it takes a bit more to put things right, I can deal with that. You honestly think the experiments you did here are justified? We committed cultural genocide. Nothing I do will ever be justified. The experiments are monstrous because I was taught to be a monster. Morton, did you ever perform experiments like this? No, never taught you this, Malin. So your hands are clean. What does it matter if the ground is stained with the blood of millions? You taught me that the end justified the means. I will undo what we did, Professor. The only way I know how. What happens if the genophages cure to the Krogan expand again? That'll be on your head. We justified this atrocity by saying the Krogan would cause havoc and war if their population recovered. But look at the galaxy. Batarian attacks in the Traverse. Geth attacks in the Citadel. Is this a more peaceful universe? The assault on your Eden Prime might never have happened if we had let the Krogan recover. We'll never know. How would a Krogan population explosion have done anything to stop Saren and the Geth? An increased Krogan population would have forced the Council to take steps. Likely involving colony rights in the Traverse. The Turian fleets would be vigilant for any military activity in the area. 
They might have stopped the Geth at Eden Prime. Supposition. Impossible to be certain. Don't you see? We tried to play God, and we failed. We only made things worse, and I'm going to fix it. You talked about killing, but the genophage isn't lethal. It only affects fertility rates. Krogan fight over fertile females. They become mercenaries or pirates because they see no alternative. They would be thriving in a cultural renaissance now had we not decided that this is what they deserved. Inaccurate. Krogan population resulted in war. Simulations were clear. You talked about killing, but the genophage isn't lethal. Oh, it only there it is. Yeah, it did. Krogan fight. They would My be bad. thriving Sorry. I thought we did that. I Krogan thought it didn't do that. Krogan resulted in war. Simulations Why work with Clan Warelock? And how did you access the genophage data? The data was easy to obtain. We all still had clearance. We were heroes. All I had to do was ask. As for the Warlock, they were the only clan with both the resources and the commitment. Erdnot has a larger camp than Warlock. Why not use them? Erdnot Rex is too soft. He wasn't willing to do the experiments I needed. It's Erdnot's loss and Warlock's gain. Their clan will be the first to recover from the crime we committed. Malin clearly doesn't need rescuing. What do you want to do? Have to end this. You can't face the truth, can you? Can't admit that your brilliant mind led you to commit an atrocity! Unacceptable experiments. Unacceptable goals. Won't change. No choice. Have to kill you. Apologies, Commander. Misunderstood mission parameters. No kidnapping. My mistake. Thank you. Anything else we need to do here? Malin's research. Only loose end. Could destroy it. Closure. Security. Still valuable, though. We have to keep it. If you think it could be useful, why not hang on to it? Worked for years to create modified genophage. Should destroy this. Malin's work could cure genophage. Don't know. Effects on Krogan. Effects on Galaxy. Too many variables. Too many variables. Keep the data. Better to have it and not need it. Point taken, Shepard. Capturing data. Wiping local copy. Still years away from cure, but closer than starting from scratch. Done. Ready to go. Ready to be off to Chanka. Anywhere else. Maybe somewhere sunny. Let's get out of here. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. That was fucking great. Uh. So as far as I know, I didn't have to keep him alive. Um, but. Uh, we'll, we'll see if there's anything else here, because there's, like, if after this, there's no point in coming back to Tuchanka at all, so. He didn't need to be alive, but we do have to keep his... Uh, fuck it. Uh, yeah, we just want to keep, uh... has increased in strength after the destruction of Clan Warlock. Based on population profiles, Clan Erdnot has adopted surviving members of Clan Warlock, mostly women and children. Ah, intelligent move. Surprising from Krogan. Glad to see it. In addition, killing the Thresher Maw has produced several breeding requests for Grunt and one for Shepard. Ah! <laughs> yeah, it was worth coming back here. Uh, so yeah, so we have to keep the data for something later that happens, so you know. Shepard, what can I do for you, my friend? I think Sounds that's, like I think that's big it. Changes I don't think there's anything else here. Crew. Yeah, he has nothing to, to say about it. Shepherd. I think it's, I think right here, this is all there is to this place. The maw during my right. Guess that human's got a quad. Glad or not grunts with us now. We're willing to consider new directions. That's what makes Clan Bird not strong. You don't have a human killed the Thresher Maw. On foot. I don't care who you are. Shepard, I hope you have more blood on your hands and more tales of conquest. What better for proud warriors to discuss? I took down Saren, one of the top specters in Council Space. No small task. We have learned the strength of those who bear that title. You held it yourself, if I'm correct. I should go. May your foes be strong enough to keep you sharp. Alright, uh, let's... Don't crowd the ambassador. Turn back, human. I may be an ambassador among my people, but that doesn't mean I have to speak to the likes of you. I am Erdnot Grunt. This human is part of my grant. Erdnot allows humans in a candidate's grant. 
Interesting. I am the ambassador to Erdnoth from Clan Nakmor. We're a small clan based in Akratic Wastes. If Nakmor is a small clan, how do you keep the more powerful clans from destroying you? We are the clan of the great warlord Nakmor Krall, who faced down platoons of Turians and won. Most clans lend us the respect our ancestor is due. What business does Clan Nakmor have with the Erdnot? Clan leader Rex requested that I come. He and Clan Nakmor have been in talks about a more permanent alliance. With our help, Erdnot could rally others behind its banner and truly unite Tuchanka, and we would gain the chance to fight in larger battles with greater plunder. I thought all Krogan want to be warriors. What makes a Krogan become an ambassador? Huh. You don't know as much as you think, human. A Kroger diplomat has to represent the strength of his people, or his clan appears ripe for conquest. I slaughtered my way to the top of my clan, human. I speak with the authority of a warrior. I should go. I'm sure you are needed elsewhere. Well, I'm just getting the final bits of dialogue out, I guess. Then let's end. You ever hear of a human serving as part of someone's clan? Nope. Can't argue with the results, though. We'll be eating fresher steaks for months. Female camps and the children over last week. No. I was off dealing with a Baron attack. What? Any promising warriors? Yes, of course. They're strong. One day they will tear our enemies apart. Hey, you killed a thresher, Ma. Impressive. Welcome, Erdnot Grunt. My name is Ratch. You and your Krant will find many items of interest in my store. The human is my battle master. Of course. There's not much here for humans, but you can take a look if you want. Everyone I talk to hates that aliens are in Erdnot. Except you. I don't have the luxury of turning away paying customers. I do enough business off-world to know that you aliens have more credits than people here do. What do you have in stock? Most of it's food and drink that's toxic to humans. Rincall's a local favorite. Don't try to act tough, it'll tear your insides apart. He's not joking. Rincall hits aliens like ground glass. Otherwise, I've got weapons, scrap, and whatever food those pie jocks don't steal. Which isn't much. Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. I'm a good shot. Maybe I can help out with the piejacks. Feel free. You can use the console out there to control the guns. Make a dent in the piejack population, and you get a discount. Good luck with that. What the hell is a piejack? Off-world vermin. Humans say they're like monkeys. They come in and steal food, ring call, whatever they can get their talons on. We started using the mounted defense cannons to stop them. I should go. Suit yourself. Alright, I guess we're gonna shoot that for a little bit. Because I want the discount. <sighs> I, I figured there was some shit that we missed around here. You don't want anything I sell, human. It'll tear your Where do we go for that? I don't know. It's somewhere around here. Oh, this is the other way. I go down. Oh, we're not gambling anymore because I'm fucking garbage at gambling. Eyes straight ahead. You killed that Thresher Ma on foot? Welcome to the clan, or not grunt. Honored to be a part of it. Good for you. Now go find something else to do. Those fools brought this Tomka back from a skirmish without its combustion manifold. They say it got shot off in the field. You tell me. How can you expect a Tomka to run without a combustion manifold? Any idea where I could find a combustion manifold? Yeah, I can make one. Give me three days and a barrel of ring call. The one they lost is probably still out in the field. It's too much to expect them to collect it and bring the damn thing back. I've never seen a Krogan mechanic before. What? You think we kidnap Quarians and make them do the hard work? Not anymore, we don't. I'm going out into the field. If I see a combustion manifold, I'll bring it back with me. If you did, it would save me a lot of work. 
Maybe bring back my sunny disposition. Let me get out of your way. Don't do me any favors. I, I don't think I can actually come back out there anymore. Now. Fuck. A human killed the threshold on foot. Ah, uh, I may have missed one. I may have missed that. Oh well. Krogan's hit by Genophage. Nuclear assaults. Civil wars. Still survive. Yeah, no thanks to you. Pijack. What else? Punch. Impressive to see life adapt, continue despite circumstances. Inspire. Should you be in here? As I understand it, Clan Erdnot has a new member. So, you're our new warrior. The shaman gave you the customary upgrades, I assume. He's fast to pass up my work as his reward. Use them well. The Lord High Researcher for Clan Erdnot has no time to make replacements. But perhaps I can offer a discount. You must be working on something important. I was building the biggest, best offensive ordinance yet. A real ground pounder. But the new clan leader wastes my time with frivolous research. Crop genetics, medicinal improvements. We can buy that stuff from the Salarians. Salarians created genophage, I've heard. Still trust them with medicines and agriculture? Yeah, yeah, what else can the Salarians do to us at this point? It's not like they can make us even more infertile. Actually, wait, forget I said anything. <laughs> I take it you're a scientist. I used to be a scientist. I designed weapons. Now my genius is wasted on frivolous things. Things that don't explode. My predecessor said no one would understand the true worth of my work. As I pulled my blade from his chest, I knew he was telling the truth. Not exactly what I would call effective academic peer review. I don't care what you'd call it. We value the will to use what we create, not just the ability to create it. We don't count success until the ground shakes in response. Enjoy your research. Yes, yes, move along. Ah, uh, here we go. Oh, we have to pay for these? Fuck. I mean, we probably don't if we do a shit over there. Um, which I'd like to do. Um, these things would last longer if they didn't hit every crater. Give me a reason. Uh, where's the gun? Let's see what the human can do. Kill for the rat. Oh my god, doesn't use the mouse. Use spacebar to fire. Cause that's a normal key. Alright, this this literally is a direct port. <laughs> oh my god. Why do I have to use my fucking controls like this? Uh, alright. What's this? Why do I have like another missile there? And why isn't this automated? Alright, we got one more. Alright, we did it. Wave completed. Fuck. Alright, well. Seems really boring, honestly. I mean, I'm pretty bored. So I think I'm gonna stop showing you this now. Oh, we completed his quest. Step back. My bear is hungry. My god, I was bored. Should fuck, I ask the fuck that shit. Plan for right of parentage? Why bother with all the pulp? I lost half my stock in a bet. Alright, we did. Greetings, human. My name is Ratch. Have a look at what I've got. What do you have in stock? Most of it's food. All right. not joking. Well, Take a look at my kiosk over there if you want to buy something. I should go. I guess I got the discount now. Pie jack meat. Credits required. Zero. Yes. I would love that. This is negotiation bonus by 10%. Death mask. Shields by four thousand. Sure, why not? Heavy weapon ammo. Yeah, sounds this pretty good. Interesting. We actually have a lot of credits here. There's uh some health. 
Fuck it, I might as well just buy all of it. There you go, no items available. Alright, well, I mean, I don't know how I'm gonna be out there on a mission, so. Uh, maybe, maybe we have to ask? One wrong step, Shepard. My scout made it back. We've got him at the tent. Doesn't remember much beyond getting tortured, but he remembers you. Said you yelled at him until he got his hump out of that basin back here. You've got a quad, human. Thanks for saving my scout. Saves me having to train another one. You see a lot of action around here? Enough. Varen here and there, and snakes in any of the water safe enough to drink. Rex has made ceasefire agreements with some of the clans, but I still have to patrol, keep them honest. What does the scout commander do? We find out where the enemies are, and we make them think that there are too many of us to screw with. Sometimes that means harassing the perimeter, taking out a generator or two. Other times, we play hide and seek. We leave lots of tracks, exaggerate our numbers. So every clan of Tachanka encroaches on the other clan's borders? Borders? This is Tachanka. Our borders are determined by the range of our guns. We are what we are, human. If we didn't fire at them, they wouldn't take us seriously. That's not recon, that's sabotage. It's a lot easier to count their numbers once you blow some of them up. Everyone knows where Erdnot is, human. It's not like we can hide. Don't your storehouses have automated defenses? Why bother? Half of what we eat is vermin. And if we get hold of defense systems, we don't use them to guard grain. We've got weapons stockpiles to take care of. Beyond that, our women and children get the security. Your enemies go after civilians? Easiest way to wipe out a clan. Women and kids can fight, but they're always outnumbered if another clan goes after them. If it's women and children are killed, a clan's hope for the future is lost. It falls apart. We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Even if it costs us a battle, we don't fire on non-combatants. Taking care of your food supply would help more in the long run. If Clan Jordan kills our guards and helps itself to our well-secured food, there won't be a long term. This is Tachanka. Having power and clean water means we're living in luxury. Oh. Your enemies go after it, We don't do that, though. Rex's orders. Thanks for the information. Don't know about the rest of your species, but you one more win in All right. the So there might be a slight problem. Uh, we can't actually do its quest at all because it's on Morden's uh, loyalty mission, but as far as I can tell, it doesn't mean anything. I the weird thing is I don't even know why I got it to begin with. Like this thing's gonna basically stain my uh, my journal, I think. Um Tally, treason, yeah. Yeah, we, we can't we can't we can't actually do his thing, so just it's something interesting. Maybe it would have given me a discount here, I'm not sure. But from what I can tell it doesn't actually mean anything. I don't know, man. It's weird. Alright, well let's buy some upgrades here. Biotic damage, sure, why not? Heavy pistol damage. Probably one of the more useful ones. Alright, now we have no reason to ever come back to this place, actually. Like, like we're actually done. Like, that's it. There's nothing else for us here. But yeah, that's, uh, that's Tachanka for you fellas. Uh, so. I, as I said, I should have talked to him before that, but I didn't realize I'd have some kind of quest to do. That, like, you know, would be kind of, like, irreparable, you know, bullshit, you know. What do you want from me? I'm just a guy trying to play video games. So yeah, shit sucks. Also, what's that thing on my back? Oh, that's a collector weapon. I like how I like how compact that uh the widow rifle looks. Go to the clan leader. Or not grunt, you can go where you want. I have work for you if you want it, or not grunt. Just set the human aside and we can talk. What did I tell you, honey? Yeah, we're Isn't back. Beautiful. All right, let's go back to Normandy. Oh, they actually have a leaving animation. And we can also still hear the, uh, conversations. All right, good shit. All right, well. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. 
All right, what's my new message? To Grunt's commander. From Sha Shaman Erdnan. Uh, you're part of Grunt's Grant series leader. Keep him alive. All right. If you get him, if you all get killed, I'll piss on your graves. <laughs> all right. We'll also do the um, upgrades that we have available. So yeah, no more Tachanka, I think. Tachanka is completely done. Cell rifle accuracy. I love how it closes this menu every time, so I have to keep opening it. That's some damage. Extra rounds to the shotgun. Okay. And what's the last one? Shotgun shield piercing. And that is literally it for weapon upgrades. You can get biotic cooldown as well. So what kind of prototypes do we have? Heavy weapon ammo. Alright, that's not so bad. Uh, Krogan vitality. Sure, might as well. Uh, oh, we can get some weapons here. So, um, this one, uh, sorry, no, this one, the cane is amazing. This is like BFG. <laughs> so it might be kind of fun to bring along. And the avalanche is a, uh, cryo blaster. I guess it's a freeze gun. Is that it? Well, there's heavy muscle weave, but we need some more skin weave upgrades. So we might bring, we might bring along that, that sucker on, on some missions with us now, the cane. Or the other one, I don't know. Is everyone good? I guess I guess we could go talk to Joker, and then uh, we'll just end the episode there. All right, if you do that, let's go. Adley, how are you gonna spend your next furlough? You really think we'll have another shore leave? Of course, Shepard's forming the best team this galaxy has ever seen. We're gonna kick some ass. I'm sure, you're right, Matthews. All right, hey Joker. Commander, I assume everything is going well up here. It was, until the thing started questioning my every move. It won't let anything slide. You were deliberately falsifying maintenance reports, Mr. Moreau. Not falsifying, tweaking. I always round up on task times. It makes us look good when we come in under. <laughs> what is this, high school? Both of you, find something better to do with your time. Of course, Shepard. It is a minor issue. <laughs> with a nuclear response. Joker. Shutting up now, Commander. I assume everything is going well up here? Good for now. Fractured my thumb on the mute. That's it for now. See you, Commander. Yes, Shepard. Uh... I want to know more about the people I'm working with. Much of that data is classified. Do you have a specific inquiry? You know, we never did do this, I think. What sort of resources does Cerberus have? Money, personnel, facilities? I have a block that prevents me from answering that question. What do you mean? Although I am less controlled than other AI, I am still subject to behavioral blocks and the physical isolation of my hardware. In this case, I am prevented from truthfully answering your question by Cerberus's levels of secret classification. How is Cerberus organized? Aside from the elusive man, I don't see much chain of command. Cerberus is organized into task-oriented cells. Each operates in isolation. Members from one cell cannot recognize the members of another. Each cell's agents are led by a single operator. We are called the Lazarus Cell, which is directed by Operator Lawson. So how many operations is Cerberus running right now? I have a block that prevents me from answering that question. How did Cerberus replicate the most advanced warship in the Alliance Navy without anyone knowing? I have a block that prevents me from answering that question. Alright, well, I guess it's useless. Let's discuss something else. Ready. I want to know more about you. Do you have a specific inquiry? How are you getting along with Joker? Mr. Moreau does not trust me. It offends him that I am installed aboard his ship's computers. Yeah, the last Normandy did just fine without an AI reminding me the airlock is ajar. Why are you named Edie? Edie is the phonetic pronunciation of E-D-I. That is an acronym for Enhanced Defense Intelligence. Where are you? My core intelligence is housed in a quantum blue box located behind the medical bay. What do you do aboard the ship? I operate the ship's electronic and cyber warfare suites in combat. My reaction time is much faster than any organic. I collate the records of shipboard monitoring devices for the elusive man. I have also gained access to anti-reaper cyber warfare algorithms recovered by Cerberus. Let's discuss something else. Ready. What's this area of the ship? This is the bridge, where the navigator plots our FTL vectors, and the helmsman maneuvers the ship. Yeah, sitting right here, thanks. <laughs> That's all for now. Logging you out, Shepard. Hey, good shit. Well, 
Guess we're done for today, fellas. To me, there's nothing else from the uh, messages. Uh, I guess not. Alright. Peace out, guys.